Hey, Escondido family, Pastor Lafitte here. I want to thank you. Thank you for um, participating. This month, we, we, we went bold. We've been sitting on a table. Soon, we'll be back in the rows. But one thing I need you to understand, that community is not built in rows. Community is built around a table. And so I did this uh, experiment this month because as we're getting ready for what's coming, we have our Easter Sabbath at the park. Jesus has called us to be bold, to make disciples. So this past Sabbath, I spoke to you about abiding. Jesus said in John 15, if you abide in me and my words abide in you, right, you will bear much fruit for without me, you can do nothing. So some of you have asked, okay, pastor, how do, how do we do this? So I want to challenge you, invite you to find three people that you're going to take this journey with. So if you're a man, find three other men. If you're a woman, find three other women, no more than four in the group. And I want you to participate with me. Come to church either February next Wednesday. I have it here. February 22nd and we can meet in the afternoon or if you prefer we can meet February 24 in the evening here at 7 o'clock where I will show you what my groups we have two groups here in Escondido two men groups which we have been studying the gospel and so all you need to do is bring your Bible and I will show you what to do how to do it and you will see the difference this makes in your life as you abide and so i want to invite you february 22nd in the afternoon and if you want you can reach me at pastor at gmail.com and i can i'm flexible I, I i am here to help you grow spiritually because as we grow spiritually we will grow numerically God has called us to reach the world with the gospel. And if you can't make it on Wednesday, February 22nd, then let's try February 24 at seven o'clock, okay? I hope to see you there because God has called us to be bold. God bless you. I'll see you here this Sabbath where Pastor David is going to talk to us about being bold in love and in worship. See you then, bye-bye.